Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Mary Grace Rice. St. Joseph will see $157,000 a year to help fight the opioid crisis. KQ2's Rusty Summers joins us in studio with more. Thanks, Mary Grace. St. Joseph and Buchanan County are getting closer to receiving opioid funds from a nationwide settlement. A settlement of more than $26 billion from big pharmaceutical companies was awarded throughout the United States for manufacturing and selling of opioids. Basically, um, the MOUs are in place with the city and county. Um, the application process has been made public, and so now it's basically just waiting for that deadline. Um, and then once we have all the applications back in, um, as part of the committee, we'll meet to review and try to start dissecting the the request and the amount of money we have available with with how it's going to um, be dispersed. The application deadline is February 29th. Kali explains the main objective of the Settlement Funds Review Board is to review the applications, you know, try to come up with how the money is going to be dispersed and then to review um, you know, once once money is dispersed, we have to go back and review and make sure that the money is being spent um, according to the settlement funds requirements. Even within the application process, you know, there's different stuff as far as uh, the types of requests, as far as if it's going to be for treatment, if it's going to be for an education, uh, prevention. And within the application process, it's outlined on how that money has to be spent. $1.6 million will be distributed to qualifying agencies in St. Joseph and Buchanan County over the next 17 years. Reporting in studio, Rusty Summers. Thanks, Rusty. 